Jay from jaysgolf.com. But today, uh, I got uh, a little tip or trick for those of you that uh, might have a Jeep, as you see behind me, or any other off-road vehicle that accepts uh, D-rings or uh, tow, tow latches. And that little secret is zip ties. Yes, zip ties. Gotta love zip ties. And I'll show you why in a second. I put you a bit lower to the ground so I can show you when I install the D-ring. The D-rings that I got are the ones that you see on. Cause they should have got some bug spray. I'll be right back. Seriously. <clears throat> Sorry about that. But yeah, in all honesty, slipper bugger, you gotta have some bug spray. De definitely recommended in your uh, off-road kit. I digress. Back to the subject at hand. I got the D-rings that you typically see on Jeeps and other off-road vehicles. As you can see, it's not the kind with a cotter pin. Uh, some actually refer to these as marine style D-rings. Um, gotta be honest with you, I don't uh, know anything about uh, uh, you know boating so I can't tell you whether or not that's accurate or whatnot but I do know that these are specific to Jeeps especially but definitely uh, you know uh, for vehicles maybe uh, uh, what's the Toyota um, wow help me not the forerunner but the um, Come on, the FJ Cruiser, yeah, that's what I'm looking for, cheat, sorry guys. Anyway, so let me put you down on a lower level, and I'll show you what I'm going to use the zip tie for. Alright, down here, and I got you guys underneath here. So we're concentrating on this, this hole right here. Let me pick you up, touch you up just a little bit. I know you're just looking at my head right now. There we go. That should be ideal. So you can see, because I got black bumper, black D-ring, black zip tie, everything is black. Alright, so. Uh, unscrew the D-ring as such. Alright, now, hopefully, again with all the black on black, etc., you'll be able to see this. Now, you may be guessing where this is going, but, okay, so I got this screwed in here now, and theoretically, it's not going anywhere. Um, but wear and tear, uh, just uh, the vibration of driving, either on road or off, typically on road. This is my daily driver as well. Uh, there is a hole in the pin. Let me switch you around here. Yeah, you see the hole? Alright, so what you do? God, I hope I have a long enough zip tie here. You thread it through the D-ring and through that hole. Alright, so you don't have to watch me struggle with this damn thing and I'll give you a bit better vantage point. I'm going to pause it come right back. Okay, this is attempt number two. And I'm in a much more aesthetic location. And I have longer 
and zip ties. So let's try this again real quick. The shorter zip ties, I thought they would work, but with my feeble fingers, I didn't have enough slack. So I think these would be better anyhow. So let's see if I can get them on here for you. I'll pause it and come back. Okay, now you can see, hopefully, exactly what I'm doing. So you thread the zip tie through the hole in the D-ring and you thread it through the D-ring itself. So, see where that is? Alright, great. Now, assuming I got this right direction on the first try. Yes, I did, okay. Now you cinch this up, like that, nice and tight, and then you snip that guy off, probably be better with a Leatherman or wire cutters, but I don't have that at the moment. There you go. Alright. Put that away. So, now you can see that the wire tie, which obviously uh, you can cut that if you need to get these off, but it will keep road vibrations and whatnot from uh, uh, dislodging the pin to your D-ring. And also, uh, it will deter any would-be thieves that would be able to just unscrew it and take your D-ring. They don't want to take the time to bother figuring out what you've done here. Uh, provided they haven't watched this video. Um, that might be a little bit of an extra security if you're in urban areas too. Uh, not just, uh, you know, off-road off and wheeling. So, Hopefully this helped, and again, I would definitely recommend 12 inch or better zip ties just for the ease of threading, threading it through. As you saw earlier, my mishap where I had to wait another 24 hours and now I'm getting eaten by bugs because I forgot my bug spray. Who goes into the woods and forgets bug spray? I do. Okay, see ya. Because the reason I thought the shorter zip, what are you doing here? Go away. Um, Wilderness. Ah. Anyway, I'm gonna have to cut that out. Oh, no, I'm not. It's funny.